Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm starting a moving series because my husband and I have to move. We are all moving out of this house and it's a little stressful, but the first order of business that I have to do is start decluttering and really like getting rid of myself and what I need to bring with me to the next place because we have definitely spread out thin. We are in a house and we're probably going to be in an apartment next, which honestly I'm excited about because I think that I do thrive in a smaller space, just having less to clean up in general, having less places to make a mess because like I have this chair next to me that has to go because I just end up putting clothes on it. So I'm gonna take you through what I'm doing right now and that is actually switching rooms. So. If you've been here, you know that this room has been my studio, my closet it switched over to. It was so simple when we first moved in here, and then all of a sudden it became like all these other things. Um, that was when it wasn't my closet. So what I'm doing is moving my vanity and my clothes, all the clothing racks upstairs into the guest bedroom, I guess, and that will be where I get ready. It's across from my bathroom, so it'll be perfect. And then downstairs we will be putting storage like boxes if we pack stuff up and I can put all the stuff that I want to try and sell and I can still use this wall for taking quotas of clothes and this will be like the taking care of business room I guess I should call it. So I have this I'm just going to cut this in half and I've done this many times because of my old job. I um, have sensitive wrists now because I am more than 10 years into my career. So yeah, wrist health is important to me. And also like body health, that's a very physical job. So I'm going to put one here, cut this one in half. I'm literally using curved eyebrow scissors right now. Like I'm so lazy. There's the first one. Doing a slit in this one. All done with my wrist brace. I'm gonna show you the room. Here is, I'm in front of the door by the way, and this is my closet. And that corner will have things. We have the chair and two clothing racks. I've started packing, so lots to uh, put upstairs. I have my jewelry over there. It's nice and clean and this dresser. Not sure where that's gonna go. And here is the door. This is the room that I'll be going into, which as you can see, I've been living here because I've been doing my hair with the ring light. And yeah, I have clothes that had to go in storage, like winter clothes. We have blankets, the bed that I lay in, and we have some random art. This is the closet. The closet does not have a clothing rack, so I don't know what I'm gonna do. We'll figure it out, but yeah. See how much stuff we have? It's ridiculous. Also, don't mind that. So this room has a lot of light. It has one window, but it's on the top floor and it's facing the back of the house. It's facing west. <laughs> I should have been up here originally, but this was actually Michael's game room. So that is why there are holes in the walls. And it just, I don't know, I've done my best to keep it looking okay, but it just needs some love. And we don't plan on being here for that long. So I'm not going to worry about it. I just want to let you guys know that this is like not up to my standards. I've like covered all of the possible holes and things or put up artwork. But yeah, the bed is gonna go downstairs and it'll feel very cozy. This room also has carpet, which also makes me feel really cozy, but the carpet kind of sucks. So we have it covered by a rug. So I'm going to put my headphones in, put on some good music, and you're just gonna see me do as, as much as I can muster.
I'm thinking the bed can go in this corner, like this way, because the closet's right there. And if I film, I can set up lights. Um, wait, no, I actually don't know how this is gonna go. Should the bed go in the middle? We shall see. It'll be easy to move around because there won't be a rug as far as now. I don't know. But here is the room, all cleaned. I think I'm going to leave that light up there. Oh, it's so bright, sorry. All the stuff is there. And the chair is pretty much clear. We do have to bring it down these stairs, which is awesome, super awesome, right? Let's take care of some of this because it's going to be a little difficult. So it's currently 2.30. I've been at it for hours. Um, I've taken a couple breaks, but there's definitely a lot to do. My clothes are pretty much set up minus the dresser. That's going to be a bit annoying. I don't know if we'll get to that today. It's no big deal. I think I just want my vanity set up. I have a box with my stuff. The drawers are still full, so that's pretty easy. But downstairs is the room that can wait because that will be the project room. The main priority is this room because I'll be living up here. My bathroom is literally across the door, so it's great. Um, I no longer have to worry about my family like or anyone walking by and me being in there getting dressed because no one comes up here except for my husband and I. I think I'm gonna have an ice cream cone. I'm probably like watch a YouTube video and then I will continue. I have my cone and it looks super professional, doesn't it? My mother worked at an ice cream shop when I was a kid and she would make ice cream cakes and I would go over to the ice cream shop after school and I would watch her make cakes, scoop ice cream, make waffle cones, all the things. I wanted to work at that place and then it was sold. So I didn't and I've never worked at an ice cream shop but whenever I get to make a cone, I make sure to like do the whole thing. Soak the scooper in hot water, scoop it out like, like I would if I was giving it to a person. It's so perfect. So I've been doing some construction. I moved this light down. It was up there and I put it too high to be honest the first time. So I think this will be better. I also removed the big pendant that was up there and now it's upstairs. The room is still chaos, but it's fine. This window makes it so difficult to film and make it bright because the sun's going down. And yeah, that's uh, where it's heading. So yeah, I have the curtains put up. That white curtain in the middle is just one panel just to filter the light. And then these purple ones are decorative. I just saw that that fell, so I had to fix that. Hung up the mirror and my belts. I have to hang this thing up, a little shelf, not sure where. I did thrift this for $6 at a Goodwill earlier this year. And yeah, it was a steal. I nearly died because it's so hoppity. I want to shower so bad. I'm so sweaty. I have this Hogwarts art with me. Don't know where I'm going to put this. This mirror is hung up specifically to cover holes and oh I forgot to fix the curtain up there. <laughs> oh my gosh. Um, yeah, I'm just trying to put things in places to cover up anchors and holes. My husband had his TV mounted to the wall, which is a very big TV. So there are anchors and holes for hanging up hue lights and all types of things that he does want to patch up. It's getting late, have not showered. Um, making progress though. Michael has been helping me. Um, I have to transfer some clothes. It's getting filled up with clothes. There's lots of clothes in general for me to go to through. Is this a white hair? It's from my cat. Lots of clothes. I have this that has my workout gear. Not all of it. I have a lot of workout gear. Honestly, too much. Um, I should probably go through this. But this I will be putting 
under here in this bin, this plastic bin, um, because this is not going to work. It's the next day and I'm about to get ready to go out to brunch with Michael and the room is getting pretty cleaned up, I should say. I did a lot of different things, so I'll just give you a little summary. So I ended up moving a shelf downstairs to upstairs and now I have a whole wall of desk and more tabletop. This Ikea calc drawer, I swear to God, it's so difficult to get rid of because it just has a lot of space. So we have the belts and I hung up these hooks that have little cute things. This is like my fairy room because my bathroom is actually kind of fairy themed. And then I have my robe on the back of the door with this little bag and some art to cover up walls. And I hung up a wand to also cover up holes. The closet is looking pretty good. I hung that green curtain that was downstairs because the door is like an ugly yellow color. And then the clothing rack, the mirror, and this is the wall. So this is my desk right now. I'm just going to quickly get my box. So now you're on my vanity and this feels right. Like this feels like I'm supposed to do makeup tutorials or something, which I do want to do. I want to do an updated makeup routine video. I will show you a uh, part two of both spaces once they are all done because I think it's important to show what it's like going through transitions and everything can be done on camera but I'll try my best. So I'll give you one last overview of what the room looks like before the end of the day, and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.